Welcome to Moo Moo Math and Science. In this video today, I'd like to show how to find the surface area of a cylinder. As you can tell, I have a 3D cylinder here. And I have two things that will hopefully make this a little bit easier when calculating the surface area. Okay, so first what I'm going to do is I'm going to unroll this and use the net so that you can see each part of it. But before that, I've got a grid because a lot of times it's confusing as to uh, what all you need to add together. So I have a grid here and I have shape, formula, substitute the numbers, and then area. So what I'd like to do first now is take the cylinder and unroll it so that you can see it uh, unrolled. Now here is your cylinder unrolled. So let's just go ahead and plug the numbers into our grid and then total it and we'll have our total surface area. So first we have this large rectangle and you can see I have the measurements. So first our shape is a rectangle. I'm going to write R for rectangle. The formula is uh, length times width or base times height. And then we're going to substitute 14 times 9. Okay, and I'm going to get my handy calculator out to do this quickly. And we go 14 times 9, that equals 126. Okay. And then we have a circle, so I'm going to put C for circle. And the formula for the area of that is one half, excuse me, pi r, pi times radius squared. And I have the diameter calculated as 4, so that means the radius is going to be 2. So we're going to go pi times 2 squared. And that is, and I'm going to use 3.14 for pi times and 2 squared is 4, and so that is 12.56. Now please remember um, that just because the diameter is 2 um, is 4 and the radius is 2, whenever you square the diameter, it's not going to always equal the diameter. It just so happened with 2. And then I've got another one of these circles, because remember I have three shapes, so I'm going to go pi times radius squared. So again, I'm going to have 3.14 times 2 times 2, which is 4, and that's 12.56. And now all I do is add this up. So I take 126 plus 12.56 plus 12.56, and that equals 151. Point one, two, and surface area, it is always centimeters squared. Okay, so I'm going to recap. I have my cylinder. I unrolled it. I had a rectangle that was 14 by 9, and then I had two circles, and the formula for area is pi times radius squared. The diameter was 4. You can see that here, and so the radius is uh, half the diameter. So that would be 2 squared, so that would be 3.14 times 2 squared, which is 12.56. I totaled all this up, and I had centimeters squared. I hope that helped with finding the area of a cylinder.